Right. So today we are going to try and see if we can make a coat rack to hang bags on. So this is all in Chinese. Ah, that's interesting. They said these were silver. Three of those. One of those. Some Chinese newspaper in here. Bits from end and rather heavy. Marble base wrapped in Chinese newspaper. That'll make an interesting read later, won't it? Get that out of the way. Well, maybe it's got the instructions on it. Instructions. Very complicated. Not. Fingers crossed. Right, so number one. We have to screw something in the bottom by the look of it. One. That looks really Interesting. Uh-huh. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. That bit and that bit. No idea where that bit goes. Or that bit. Actually. Or where the screws go. But anyway. If we take these bits off here, I'm trying to work out. Where this bit goes, and what are the bits in here? All Chinese to me. All in Chinese. <clears throat> and it's wrapped in plastic. And sellotape. So that is. Which is plastic. It is plastic as well. Not quite sure where that goes. And these are also plastic. No holes in these. Excuse me, I've got a bit of hay fever here. That way, I'm pretty sure it goes that way, like that. 
that. Ah, I see. So that attaches to there. And my dog back on this side. Monty! Monty! Right. So, I presume this is really problem solving. That those screw into there. So, now so we need to find a. rubber washer on it. There's no hole there so we're going to make a hole. It's my dog Monty barking outside. Washes must go on the other side like that. And like that. Where they fit like that. Just gonna have a look at this hole. Made a hole in it now. If you've done one of these before, well done. Again, if it lines up in there, but we will attempt it. And see how we go. They don't give you much to go by. Luckily, I'm a visual person. Hello, Patch the Cat. Come in to see me. Yeah, there should be a match in one of these holes at the bottom. Almost done. Not. One, two. So how many of these have we got? Well that's nice, that's bent. Three, four, five, six. Right. We're back and oh, I'm a bit gutted really. I'm already missing one of these little black things from in here. It's nowhere to be found. But this is the top. Right, so the next thing on what we do here is join it to another post. We've got, I don't know how many posts we've got, I presume they are all the same. Maybe. Same links. So we shall take this one. Yeah, sounds pretty light and cheap, but here it goes. So, actually, I think we need to put this cheap and nasty piece of plastic. Oh my god, this is awful! Look at that. Can you see that? That's just cheap and nasty. Right. No, that doesn't go there. Right. 
So that goes in the hole. Hello. Well, it's definitely worth the money you paid for it, that's for sure. Not much. bit either. I should try that again. Why does it have a rubber band on it? Oh look it's made out of a nestle tin. Look at that. Recycling. Recycling. Can you see that? No you can't see that. Try this one. Can you see that? Have a look. Why does it have a rubber band on it? Tell me why does it have a rubber band? Yeah. Hmm. Why does it have a rubber band and some ball bearings on it there? Yeah. That is really interesting. So these are made out of it says Nestle on it and then it's all in Chinese, so I have no idea. But anyway, yep, I have no idea how that goes. Or why it has a rubber band on it. has a gap there. I think we'll just put that bit aside because it might be in the too hard basket for now and then we shall put why does it have a rubber band on it anyway? One of those and one of those. One of those and one of those. Right. No idea why that goes at the bottom. Two more of those. This is really stupid. Complicated. Oh yes, if you've done a hundred, well, that's all good, isn't it? Let's start from the bottom and work up. Obviously that goes in there. What are these for? One, two, one, two. One's longer, one's shorter. I presume that goes in the bottom. Um, yep, maybe. Right, let's try this. Do we need a washer on which side? I think we'll put the washer on the bottom. Oh look, I found the black bit. Yes! What's happened here? Okay, we're back again. What's happened here? We're going to start from the bottom and work up. Washer, screw. <laughs> Bolt actually. Put that up there. Ooh, that's heavy. And then we shall put that on. That's meant to go on there. I'll just put this little black thing down before I lose it again. Oh. Oh, I don't know if I can 
see what I was doing. Oh, the reason why I have got a marble base is because the other ones, when you don't, when you hang a lot of weight on the top, especially uh, heavy jackets or bags or, or whatever, they tend to tip over. So uh, this one does not tip over. Just disappointed that a lot of it is plastic. But however I'm saying that, the seam doesn't want to go in very well. Whose idea was this? That's better. Much better. Maybe if I screw that in. Turn that, turn that. And there we go. We have a base bit. Yay. Right, the next thing is uh, I presume it's this bit here. Just guesswork. But uh, I don't know how far we screw it in. What we put in between. One of these maybe. This is a bit bent. Just going by the picture here of what it looks like to where everything goes. presume we have another one of these, a longer one, don't ask me why it's a long one, it's a longer one. Not quite sure how far to put it in but uh, yeah don't forget that in there like that. Not a cheap bit of plastic but oh. oh look at that almost done. So what I need to do now I still don't understand why there yeah, is a rubber band in there. Is I need to put this little black bit that I thought I had lost forever. Into this. screwdriver would be nice but that's okay we will do it this way so I need to put it behind it not in front of it I've done that so many times already squeeze that in there it's all in the way you hold your tongue You know, you can pay hundreds of dollars for ones with nice metal bits on them, but, you know, I'm quite happy with this one. It does does the job, and I'm so pleased to see this recycled tin that they're using. If you 
can see that. I'm not sure if you can see that. It's got a thing on the inside. If you have a look at that one. It's recycled. What I like. Don't really know why that has got that one has two. So maybe it just sits there like that. Right, so I'm going to put the top on. Just putting the top on here, spinning it around. Hopefully that's gonna make it tighten up. Maybe not. going to spin round. I might just undo this bit because that looks really wobbly. Definitely a good idea to do this bit first. Here we go, click, click, click. And then this bit up here as well. Don't think that's going to loosen, tighten up much more. So it looks like this. And we put the middle bit back together. Just got the little bits that go on the see these bits? Yeah, they just poke on the end. And if they're a bit loose, you just put some uh, bit of tape on the inside and it stops them falling off. Just tighten up this whole thing on the bottom, I think it needs to be tighter. Feels like it's going around in circles. That's better. Right. You just poke those on. Everything's 
bigger than a single use play stick, that's for sure. Oh, they go on the silver ones too. do the job and there we go and I will also give you a finished view with it on my bag with my bags on it so that'll look pretty good ideal for what I want if I'm going to do an expo because I don't have room for a big bag rack anyway um, I'll get back to you in a minute